I'm Bailey, and today we're going to be showing you guys how to make two Easter treat slash gifts. It's kind of bold. They're both, yeah. yeah. And we're so excited to show you guys these. They are super delicious and, and cute. super cute. So let's get started. So our first gift is going to be a like a carrot, mm -hmm. and you need all these. These are all of your ingredients. Ingre I, I guess know. you could I say. I don't really know what they're Anyways, <laughs> our first one is cheese balls slash cheese puffs, whatever cheese you puffs. like to call them. Um, you, <laughs> the next ingredient is these frosting bags, and they look they like this. They come looking like this, kind of like a triangle, triangle shape. And our last thing is this green curling string, or curling, you know, ribbon. Guess. It's like a little uh, string that's on the bottom of a balloon. That's what it is. And then last but not least, scissors. scissors. Your first step, you're going to want to take your decorating bag and if they will hold this for me. Of course, I'll be the model holding it. Then you're going to want to take your cheese puff, cheese, cheese balls, <laughs> either one, and you're going to want to dump it into, we're going to try doing this without, without spilling, spilling, which might okay. be a difficult task. Okay, ready? Okay. Go. Is it open all the way? Yeah, it's open all the way. Try. Ah. Here, open the. Okay, got it. Ooh, scales. Oh. <laughs> Ooh. Woo! Woo! I need to pour some of those back in. <laughs> okay, and once that's done, <laughs> you're going to take the top like so and get your little. Balloon ribbon or your curling ribbon. Will you hold this for me? Yes. And you will tie the top. You can tie it in a knot, you can tie it in a bow, either or. I'm going to tie mine in a knot. And then, oh, hold on, there you go. Tying it in a knot. And then I'm going to take the ends and I'm going to curl them. Okay. <laughs> and it's, there we go. There we go. <laughs> Uncooperative ribbon. And there we, there we go. go. Oh, we got a good one. <laughs> okay, let's try this one again. No, no, wait. Okay. Oh my. Curl. Okay, that's there. It's better. <laughs> Gonna curl the ribbon. And there you go. You have your Easter carrot. <laughs> Our next carrot, I guess you could say, is going to be made out of sugar cones. And these are from Walmart, but you could basically find them anywhere. They're just plain sugar cones. And then we're also going to be using another one of our disposable ice icing bags. And then we also have this ribbon. It's just pink polka dotted. You can basically use whatever ribbon you want to. And again, we got all of this from Walmart. And last but not least, we have our peanut M&Ms. And they're Easter colored, but again, it doesn't matter what color they are. You can use whatever kind you want to. And then scissors. So to start, I'm going to take my icing bag, and then I'm going to take one of my ice cream cones and put it in so it is filling the bottom of the bag. So you can see that. And then I'm going to have you hold this. All right, then. And then I'm going to take my M&M bag and pour the M&Ms in so they reach about the top of the ice cream cone and then you're going to want to pour a little bit more so it's about two to three inches of M&M's bolding over the top of the ice cream cone. So, here we go. Let's pour these in there. That's about where we want it. After you've filled your ice cream cone with M&M's, I'm going to take my ribbon and tie it around the top. So, let's tie this in. You tie in a cute little bow. Yeah, tie in a bow. And if you don't want to fill it as high as needed, you can always stuff the cone with tissue paper, or you could like pour in a little bit less M and M's. It's totally up to you. And there you have your adorable spring carrot. I actually thought at first that it was an ice cream cone, not a carrot, because it kind of looks more like an ice cream cone, don't you think? Yeah, I can, I can see that. Yeah. I think it's probably supposed to kind of look like a carrot to bring in the Easter theme, but then it kind of looks like an ice cream cone, because ice cream cones kind of like summer, springy, and they, you can find the ice cream cones because it's warm outside. I still think it looks like a carrot. 
I think it's an ice cream cone. Whatever. You decide. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Be sure to follow us on Twitter at Brooke and Bailey. Also, don't forget to leave a comment below on which carrot slash ice cream cone is your favorite. And we will see you guys next week. Bye. News, and we are so glad we had the opportunity to do that. And there is also a comment section. If you click on the link and watch the video, you can say like, hey, Brooklyn and Bailey sent us. You're gonna take your cheese puff slash cheese balls, I don't really know what you wanna call them. You're gonna take this huge thing and just pour, pour it in. in. It's gonna be difficult. And we're gonna try and do this without spilling. Then go ahead. Hold on. Ah! Got it, okay, go. And you're gonna wanna just like keep. Ah!